What's good, YouTube? This is Austin Sweet here, and you're watching the Sweet Life of Dakota and Austin. Welcome back to the channel, guys. And today, I want to welcome you guys to episode two of Top Tens Rebooted. And in this episode, we're going to be talking about, we're going to be doing my top ten, um, we're going to do another top ten songs. And these are my, and this is in my opinion. Now with this one, you either, you either love the band or you hate the band, but we're doing my top ten favorite Nickelback songs. Alright. So, without any further ado... Let's get into this top 10. All right, starting off at number 10, we have the song Animals, and that's off the album All the Right Reasons. This song came out in 2005. Song's actually really good. It's kind of like inappropriate for what it is. It's like talking about like a relationship going crazy. I mean, really really crazy song i mean everything about the song is just crazy i'm like holy cow so definitely give that song a check out number nine is gotta be somebody that's off the album dark horse this song came out in 2008 um what this song's basically talking about is like you're trying to find the one that that you can settle down with and basically um you want to live the rest of your life with um that song, when I first heard it, it was my, it was a mind blower. I'm like, holy cow, this song's really good. So definitely give that a check out. Number eight is Lullaby, and that's off the album Here and Now. This song came out in 2011. When I first heard this song, I was like, oh my God, this song is depressing, and boy, was I right. Um, I was really right. This song is so depressing. The music video is even depressing. I mean, holy cow. I can't even describe the music video, let alone the song. But definitely check that out. That's a really sad song, but a good one. Number seven is Trying Not To Love You. And that's off the same album here and now. Released the same year, 2011. When I first watched this video and I first heard the song, I was like... Wow. It's basically like you're trying your best not to love like your significant other. Just crazy, crazy song right there. But definitely give that a check out. Number six is Rockstar. Off the out and it's off the album All the Right Reasons. The song came out in 2005. In my opinion, it's one of my favorite Nickelback songs. I'm surprised I didn't rank it number five. Um but I love, 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 love that song. That song I can listen to, like, all day. That's how much I love that song. It's basically, like, what you want to do when you get older. Definitely give that a check out. Number five is Photograph. We are in the top five. Number five is Photograph. And it's off the album All the Right Reasons. This song came out in 2005. This song itself is really good. It's basically talking about like reflecting on like past memories, basically taking you down memory lane. Excellent, excellent song. The music video for that is really, really sad, but it's a good song too. It's coming from the heart. Okay, number four is If Today Was Your Last Day. This is off the album Dark Horse, released in 2008. This song, it's like it's like Tim McGraw's Live Like You Were Dying. Like, if today was your last day and if tomorrow was too late, like, what would you do? What would you do if today was your last day? That song alone is really good. I love that song. Definitely give that a check out, too. I haven't watched the music video for it, but definitely give that a check out. Number three is Far Away, and it's off the album All the Right Reasons. The song came out in 2005. Oh, my God. This song alone is really, really depressing and sad. Um, but it was just, when I first heard this, it was crazy. Because I saw a little bit of the music video and the music video alone, a little bit of it was really sad. Definitely give that song a check out. I love that song. Excuse me. All right, we're getting out of the nitty gritty here. Number two is Saving Me off the same album, All the Right Reasons. 
same year, 2005. It's basically like you're fighting your inner demons and you are trying to save yourself from those inner demons. My opinion, the song's really good. Um, it works really well. The music video was crazy. It's like, holy cow. So definitely give that song a check out. Now, I was going to do an honorable mentions um, with Nickelback, but they got so many good songs, it was hard to do an honorable mentions. So, in the near future, I will do another top 10 Nickelback songs. Anyways, we're to my number one favorite Nickelback song, and that is Burn It to the Ground. Number one is Burn It to the Ground. Off the album Dark Horse, released in, that song was released in 2008. Basically, it's like going out, having a good time, and just basically having a good time, burning it to the ground. Song is really good, very, very catchy. Um, at the same time, it was actually the theme song to Monday Night Raw in 2011. Don't believe me, go look it up. WWE Raw theme 2011, that's exactly what it was. That's what got me hooked on Nickelback. So overall, definitely give Burn It To The Ground a check out and go check out the music video for that too. It's really good. And that'll do it for this episode of Top 10's Rebooted. I thank you very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure you hit the like button, leave your comments, and above all else, subscribe, tap the bell, turn on notifications so you don't miss the next video, and I will see you guys in the next episode. If you guys missed the previous episode of Top, 10, Top 10's Rebooted, I'll, put you, I'll link you into the cards and the annotations at the end of this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace and game over.